Hi, this is Jonathan. Today we're going to feature another guitar from Pauletti. This is the Pauletti SSH in Fireman's Blue. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
If you're new to this channel, might just want to subscribe to this channel and press the bell for notification of future videos that follow and be part of the patrons to support this channel, I would appreciate it. I want to thank Amelia Singapore, especially Mel and Moose, uh, for passing me this guitar for review. Now, this is from Pauletti, Italy. Uh, their guitars are, well, especially the body is made from reclaimed um, chestnut wood that was made from wine barrels. So if you're interested in the history, you might just want to check out the links that I have in the description box and you can kind of find out the company's history and how they make their wood. So you have a, a, a Canadian roasted maple neck, ebony fretboard with a fret radius of 12 inch. You also have uh, jumbo frets with a bone nut of a nut width of 42 mm. You have uh, deluxe, cruising deluxe tuners, non locking. The, the, you know, the traditional ones where you slide the strings. I, I like those the best. A string tree there. And uh, of course, this beautiful body. Now, this time around, you don't see much of the wing effect that I have on my signature model. Um, yes, I do have a signature model from Paul Eddie, so you might just want to check out the, uh, the video. Uh, this has that sort of a feather effect right here, as well as the side here. Yeah, nice. I like the finish of this. Uh, it gives you a three-dimensional effect when you look at it from afar. You know, you have a five-way selector switch, pick up selector switch. You have a volume and two-tone control. Uh, the last being a push-pull for the split call of the last humbucker pickup on a bridge. So these pickups are almost similar to the ones that I have on my signature model. You have the Polity 60s, uh, single coil for the neck and the middle with really nice wooden uh, pickup covers. And then you have the Rock 2 for his humbucker, same as mine. The only difference is that I have a P90 uh, on my neck. Now the pickups are really great. Pauletti makes really nice pickups and uh, it's a nice combination between the wood, the chestnut wood and the way Mr. Pauletti designed the guitar with the design of the pickups. It just, you know, it just has a wonderful combination, just clean, you know. The thing I discovered about Pauletti guitars is that they cut through the mix and it's clean. It's not like model or anything like that. It's a very nice tone, a very clear signal and this is of no difference. Um, the the ebony fretboard gives a little, a little bit more spank. Um, I like it, you know. Uh, and this guitar also sounds very different. Mind you, I played a couple of these before uh, with rosewood fretboard. So every uh, fretboard material, yeah, it, it just gives a little bit of a different uh, character to the guitar. Not much of a whole lot of difference, but there is a difference. Uh, Playability-wise, this has a uh, what you call it, a medium C profile, really comfortable, just like my uh, signature model. The only thing that is different is this nut which is at 42 mm, whereas mine is at 43 mm. Um, easy to play, you know, with the fret radius of 12 inch and the jumbo frets. And then the sound, right? So like I said again, the pickups are really nice. I love the single calls that Paul Eddie makes because they are really spanky, really clear, and pristine, and nice. You know, it has that body. A lot of single calls uh, have all that um, pristine sound, the, the brightness and the chime, but lacks the body. This has the body too. And of course, the humbucker, the rock too, sounded really good. You know, they have the bite and the body at the same time, just like the single call in many ways. So, uh, for Pauletti guitars, I'm not afraid of uh, like playing overdriven sound, lead sound with my bridge, uh, with my neck pickup because it can cut through, you know, and it still has that girth, you know, to, to pull to pull off a lot of stuff that I wanted to to um, emphasize, you know, which I wanted to to, to create, you know, uh, and I seldom use um, neck pickups for overdriven lead sound. I guess, yeah, only different guitars, you know, certain guitars, hmm, doesn't sound so good. But for, so far, for all the Pauletti's, even for the P90s, it's nice. Yeah, and the guitar comes in with a strap lock, so yeah, it's applied. Really nice looking case, uh, just ready for rock and roll, you know. Nice uh, Pauletti uh, neck plate here, neck joint. This, of course, is a brass uh, pick guard, but this time it's in silver to complement the silver hardware. As, as, you know, same goes for the shotgun shell. These are all in silver hardware, and I think it complements really nicely with the Fire Miss Blue. You have little dashes of silver over here. Cool, nice looking guitar. Let me know what you think about this guitar and leave the comments in the comment section down below. Um, guitar is available in Singapore. 
in uh, from Amia Singapore. So if you're in Singapore, this pop up down to Peninsula uh, and give this a try. There are a couple of models there too. So yeah, if you're not in Singapore, if you're in the US or in Europe, there are dealers both in North America as well as in Europe. So uh, the, the links are all in the website. So you can just check them out. Right? If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel. Press that bell for notification of future videos to follow and be part of Patreon to support this channel. I would appreciate it. Um, I want to thank all my wonderful patrons for their wonderful love, their friendship and their support. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, in the meantime, continue playing guitar and I'll see you real soon. Ciao, ciao.